we're not even a solid mass. None of us are. Do you know that we have more, we have almost 99% of our exterior as a body is covered in bacteria. Uh, this is a fact. We are all just a clump of cells that seem to work at the same frequency. And what I see that the Q drops do is tune in to people to think at the same frequency. Does that make sense? Um, meaning that they all decide to have objective perspective. So one drop that can say like this one, the first one that we referred to timestamp 444, Hillary Clinton, you know, getting arrested on Monday. Uh, one person viewing that would see it as, Oh, maybe that's going to happen. Another person seeing it will say that's already happened. Another person says, well, it's happening. Uh, time is of your perspective. And if people can understand that your time moves in cadence with events, kind of like, hey, today went by really quick. Um, it's because you're enjoying or you're understanding, kind of like um, I'm, I'm going to try to make this as simple as possible because it was a great conversation uh, we had uh, just a couple of days ago on the Chan board with a bunch of my nerdy friends. Um, when you're in class, when you were in class, in high school or whatever, there was always this topic you hated. For me, it was grammar. I, I suck. I just don't like it. I don't understand the structure of the English language, right? Other foreign languages have more of a structure. The English language is one of the most difficult languages for people to learn because it's not um, structured mathematically. I'll put it that way. So when you're in a class that you can't understand, time does not go by because you struggle with what's in front of you. So for us, when we see these news that are coming at us, we innately as human beings accept it as fact so that time can move faster for us in that thought.